Hello everybody. So we have a big unboxing to do today. This came from Amazon and it's like most of what we ordered. Hello. Hello. A bunch of stuff. Box of stuff. Okay, these are those plugs for my ears. I'll show you those in a minute. This is mine. And this is yours. What we did season two. It's a game though. Don't worry. You do not have that one. You have the first one. That's yeah. the second one. And then there's these, but they are not black like that. They're not supposed to be anyway. So I had to order more of these because the ones I had got pinched or something, in the cord, and they got wrecked. Only one side worked. So, yep, I got new ones. So we'll have to make sure, I don't know if they got caught in the zipper of the case or what happened, but I have to make sure that doesn't happen again. And this is, oh this is uh, the mug, there's two of those for camping. Which I don't know how camping is going to go this year with all the shutdowns and the closures and they even have the free campsites around here closed. These go along with our uh, thing, uh, coffee. What? What's that thing called? Percolator. Yeah, for making coffee on the on the camp fire. There's a hook up in here too. And this is the same thing. And then these, I got these. They are one size up. So I'm gonna go one more size up. And then that's it because. I can't get nice pretty ones for my ears at only size 2, so I have to go to size 0. So later on I will get these put in my ears. It's, it's a cat with a moon. So I have to stretch my ears one more time. And then that will be absolutely the end. Oh, and this is that ethernet cord we need for the for the desktop computer I got from my dad that for some reason can't do Wi-Fi even though it's not very old so that'll be uh, be good to get that finish setting that up with the part I need for the internet for and then the most important part is right here so the gimbal for the camera so I'm going to have to figure out how to use it and get it all set up and everything. The seller sent me tutorial videos on how to set it up and use it. So I'll have to finish watching those. But this way we'll have steady footage instead of the shaky footage you're seeing right now comes with a case. Hey, it's not gold plated. No, why would it be? It better be gold plated. Oh, More than gold plated. I guess I accidentally just turned it on, not meaning to. There it goes. They say don't turn it on without the camera on it yet, but I bumped the buttons. But I'm sure it's going to need to be charged first. But anyway, that's the, the giant unboxing. Don's getting the uh, Ethernet cable set up. It goes from here, down here, over here. 
uh, through there, up here, over there, up here, he's got it hooked to the fan, and it will come down and go to that one right there. That way it's not laying on the floor and we're not tripping on it. Oh, you putting a hook up there? Yeah. It looks, I mean, it looks fine. Nobody will look up and notice it. And it's a whole lot better than it just laying on the floor to be tripped on. In the meantime, the gimbal is charging. I don't think it has too much charging to do. And then I will get it set up follow those tutorial videos and how to balance it and all that and the carpet baggers enamel pin also came today these sold out in not his last live stream which was last night but the one before it which was last Thursday I ordered mine the night before and then they had the live stream and they the rest of them all sold out during that live stream so I'm lucky I got it when I did and this smaller desktop is all set now online and all customized like it has wallpaper now and all that stuff I couldn't do when it wasn't on the internet so that's good and I decided that I will just unhook the Ethernet cable from it and put it in here when I edit because videos are supposed to upload faster directly wired anyway instead of on Wi-Fi so this is for editing videos and this is for everything else and this is all charged and ready to go so now I have to figure out how to use it and I can't lie and say I'm not nervous about it because I am okay it's on there I still have to figure out all the buttons like what I don't know None of the buttons are going to work because this cord won't connect. It connects to the camera, but it won't connect to the gimbal like it's supposed to. This end is this end is wrong, which doesn't make sense because it's the thing that came with it. But anyway, I don't know how to turn it around. supposed to be some way to turn this whole gimbal around and I just don't know how so I guess I still have to do this until I figure it out am I in frame yeah so anyway it should be more steady now instead of uh, wobbly Try walking around with it some. Yeah, it's hey. it steady. It didn't want to balance, according to the video, but it's working anyway. It might be too late for the camera. Yeah. wobbly stuff and walk around with it and not get my footsteps you doing laundry yeah but anyway at least everything is steady but I have more to figure out on it because I know I definitely don't know everything on it yet and I have to get this base off the bottom of it tripod base because it's making it really heavy so Don's gonna start working on the car at least he said he's uh, looking at stuff that's what he said uh -huh. 
Higgins got it up on the ramps, but he borrowed from his brother. guys can't hear this this gimbal running. I have a feeling you might be able to, but whatever. At least it is smooth footage. I might have to calibrate it. I was reading about calibrating it to uh, keep it straight. Pretty good so far though. I can't use any of the buttons on it because it's not the right kind of camera to hook the cord up, but that's alright, whatever. At least everything is well, good thing about that steady. Grinder. Yeah. Yeah, because I wouldn't be able to do this job without it. Yeah. Yeah, Don just came home from town with a grinder. Yeah, because I was in town, I was like, well, I wonder if I got a cut pipe. Cutting it with my fingers ain't gonna work. Yeah. So, and I do gotta cut some pipes, so. It's really warm out here today, though. Yeah. Well, like 70. Yeah. So. Get started with the new stuff. Yeah. So, anyway, we can turn this upside down and it stays steady. It's upside down now. And it's still steady. <laughs> maybe they're not upside down, maybe we're upside down. Oh, sure. Oh, I didn't drive the car off the ramp. This is strange. I wonder if it's sending some kind of signal to the, uh, to the camera, because the camera, the footage on it isn't up. No, maybe it is upside down. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to flip this. You guys are upside down. I don't know. Here. Yeah. I'm just going to have to keep uh, practicing. Because I definitely don't know what I'm doing. Entirely. But it's nice to have it. At least we know everything will be steady. Yay. Right, Tug? Right, Tug? So Don's down there working on it. You said it's almost done, right? Yeah. It's almost done. Good. Another car won't sound like crap anymore. But I've just been in the house setting up new things like that computer is all taken care of. And I set up those new Bluetooth earbuds. They're just the same as the other ones I had before, but they're a different color. For some reason there's a different name on them, but they're exactly the same otherwise. And they're all set. So, that's good. And we've been doing the laundry. Washing bedding. It's probably like 70 out, so today's a good day to get the bedding nice and fresh. And we're going to try out one of those new sheets, because we haven't yet. We got rid of the old worn out sheet from two years ago. You having fun down there? Yep. I already got one plan. I'm fine. Doing the second right now. Okay. And then we can start it up and see how it sounds. So while he works on that, I'll show you where the new newest signs got put here in the shed. I'm pretty sure I didn't yet. There we go. I'm so practicing on how to uh, maneuver this thing so it goes where I want it to go. But I'll figure it out. And in the meantime, there's the rest of the signs in here that you guys have seen before. But there will be more over time. Okay, it's done, and now we can see if it sounds any better. Yeah, it's a screw test right here. Yeah. Huh. Sounds like a whole different car. <laughs> nice and quiet. Yeah. Time to drive off the ramps. 
There you go. Yep, I don't hear anything. Well, you're the roar of the motor in that thing. And now we'll be able to listen to music in the car and hear it and talk to each other and hear each other. There you go. Yep. I'm done. Thank you. I did my bad deed for the day. Yeah. Yep. Well, you did a good deed. Well, it was a bad deed. No. So I really, really hope this fixed the problem. Don tightened everything up as tight as he could get it. I hope the vibrating is gone. Because that was terrible. That kind of ruined the whole video, and I really want to apologize for all that horrible noise in your ears. So I'm really sorry. Hopefully this will take care of it. And I also figured out why I couldn't really point it at anything like I wanted to. It's because I had it on the wrong settings. But in the meantime... We're just going to have dinner because we've been busy all day and it's getting really late. So we're going to say good night and we hope you enjoyed the video and that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. Good morning. All right, it's moving and so far I don't hear anything, so I sure hope that fixed the problem. And we'll see you next time.